Every parent wants the best for their child, but when it comes to education, it can be difficult for a child with learning challenges to thrive in a regular classroom setting. And so there is a very small school in Victoria focused on helping those children reach their full potential and become happy, productive members of the community. La, 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 now this is how you put the fun in fundraiser. Here we are. Oh, look at that. Balloons, games, face paint, food, hey, even a visit from Marty the Marmot. Oh. So what are they raising money for? For our school, for some desperately needed supplies, infrastructure, um, hopefully eventually some transportation, subsidizing. The school is Strong Point, which offers a therapeutic learning program for children kindergarten to grade seven with learning and developmental challenges. Well, we've been lo losing money from the start, but we're providing a very good service for the kids that really need it. Can you start here? What comes after O? They all have individual education plans. In some classrooms, they're four on one with the teacher. In other situations, they're one on one. And what's after V? It's one of the most awesome schools I've ever been to. Caleb was in public school, but his mom moved him to Strong Point. Just with his needs and demands that he needs on a one-to-one -one basis for most of his schooling, it was an opportunity that I just couldn't say no to. Good try, you want another one? Karen's son is thriving in the small school. The learning is tailored towards his needs and his learning styles. In the bucket. Everyone's trained in special needs and autism. And I'm not getting phone calls home because of his behavior. They know how to handle it really well. So it's been good for him. Let's go swing on the swing. The school is capped at just 20 students who receive physical, behavioral, and speech therapy. Strong Point receives funding from the Ministry of Education, and parents of students requiring one-to-one -one care allocate their autism funding for an educational assistant. But the staff and parents want to help the kids in other ways. They're getting the clinical visits like the occupational therapy and the behavioral consultant, but you know, school's more than that school is playground equipment and the little extras, right? We are going to be fundraising all year, doing little things um, and hopefully getting some community grants to, to just keep our school going. Learn more about Strong Point at the links tab on our website. Victoria Foundation, connecting people who care with causes that matter.